Hey Oak Park, I want to share some exciting news with you today. I want you to save the date October 18th in your calendar. That is the day that we are going to reopen our sanctuary for Sunday morning worship services. Uh, now there's a whole lot of details that go into reopening. There's a lot of logistics, a lot of ways that we're trying to follow the guidelines. Uh, and all of those are going to be in a letter that we sent uh, to you through email and through, uh, through the postal service. And so make sure you're watching for those. But right now, I just really want you to put that on uh, your calendar and start getting excited about it. And I also want to say a word to, about how we came to this decision because I think it's important. I, I know it's been a long time. I never dreamed that we would be doing virtual services this long. Uh, but I hope you won't con confuse the amount of time it's taken us to make this decision with idleness because we have been researching the guidelines as they've evolved. We've been talking to churches who have opened and what their experience has been like and what kind of mistakes they've, uh, they've seen happen and what kind of loop polls they see and we've also just been trying to work towards unity and consensus on our council in fact we uh, we spent the last uh, the last week before our most recent council meeting, we, we fasted from all media together and we prayed every day that God would just show up and give us unity as a council. And, you know, God showed up in a great way. We were able to, to smoothly uh, work through uh, the different questions that people had. And we came up with a plan that was, uh, that was voted in by consensus, which was really important to me. I, I want this, this time of divisiveness, this time of upheaval. I really want it to be a time where Oak Park becomes uh, more and more together and more and more one and part of that part of that uh, is that we want to make sure that when we reopen those of you who decide to stay home for your health we want to make sure that you get the best experience that you can get. And uh, frankly, we've had some issues with our li live stream technology, and that's another reason why we've been hesitant to reopen in person. And so this lag time between the decision to reopen and October 18th is really a time period for myself and the pastoral staff to work out all the tech technological bugs so that those of you who decide to stay home, uh, that you are honored and given um, and given the best quality experience that you can have uh, so that we want you to feel like you're here with us. And so that's what we're going to be working on over the next five to six weeks is making sure that uh, there's a unity, there's a, an equality between the experience of those who come on Sundays and those who decide to stay home so that we don't feel like we're creating two churches. And so uh, that's kind of the lowdown. Those are the details. Set your, uh, mark your calendar for October 18th. Look through your, look in your email and in your mailbox for more details about what all that's going to look like. And pray for us. Join me in praying that this will be a healthy decision, a wise decision, and that, uh, and that Oak, God will bless Oak Park as we, we continue down this road together um, and continue to try to live faithfully within these crazy times that we've been entrusted with. So have a great day and I can't wait to see you on October 18th.